Yeah, RC Gaming here, and welcome back to the Wolf Career Mode Season 2, Episode 4. Yep, this is Episode 4. In the last episode, we played our first Champions League game, got a really good victory against Porto. Finally picked up our first clean sheet in the Premier League with a 5-0 win over Burnley. That was good. Good fun. Curtis Jones uh, played really well in that one. And we got... Uh, we went for one up against Liverpool in the first half and that pretty shitty second half so I wasn't happy with that one in this episode we got three really big games Millwall, Tottenham and Real Madrid um, you guys will be seeing the highlights of the Millwall and Spurs games and the Real Madrid game will be the biggest is the biggest game in the next episode it will be Villa City, Salzburg, and Brighton, EFL Cup, Chelsea. That's how it's going to work. So, without further ado, let's get into the points and get into the highlights after that. So, um, in 30th place, we have Ever on one point. In 29th, Emil Smith Rowe on one point. 28th is Luke Kundal on two points. 27th is Justin Cliver on four points. 26th is Neko Williams on 7 points 25th Aaron Martin on 7 points 24th Ryan Gold on 7 points and 22nd and 23rd on 8 points both on 8 points is Felix Nemecha and Diego Jota respectively um, 17th, 18th, 19th, 20th and 21st are Adama Traore, Morgan Gibbs-White, Brandon Williams, Eric Garcia and Leander Dendonka all on 9 points in 16th we have Keanu Whoever sitting on 10 points, 15th is Ferran Torres on 12 points, 14th is Eric Dyer on 14 points, 13th is William Saliba on 14 points, 12th is Rui Patricio on 21 points, 11th is Kieran Tierney after he scored his first goal for the club against Burnley on 23 points sorry, 10th uh, also on 23 points is Daniel Marlon, 9th is Lucas Chevalier on 27 points, 8th is Wilfred Ndidi on 29 points, 7th is Nicolas Pepe on 32 points, 6th is the one of the most surprising players last season was Curtis Jones on 34 points, in 5th is Bukayo Saka not having a great season I don't think so far on 43 points, 4th is Gabby Martinelli on 45 points, 3rd is Ruben Neves on 48 points, 2nd is Mason Mount on 74 points and leading the championship, uh, he's led the championship in every game this season Erling Haaland on 138 points so let's get into the games against Millwall uh, we will be playing we'll be using three different starting 11s for all three games so yeah enjoy the highlights and I'll speak to you during the Real Madrid game
opposition sets up against them, they have the power to break them down. It's really exciting, it's really entertaining. And as you've seen, yet again, it's really effective. Well, it looks simple, but this lad has got a great instinct to drift it into space, being in the right place at the right time. in this current mode. Um, we, yes, we beat Real Madrid in the last game played against them in the Super Cup final, but I have a bad feeling Real Madrid are going to be a lot better this game. No Haaland on the bench to bail us out. No Neves on the bench to bail us out. How are we going to fare up in this one? As long as we don't get spanked, I don't care. Good habits every time you take to the field. Should be a good one though. Don't really care if we win or lose this one. Bale. Just as long as we Bale. try our best. And, we'll and we give a good go at Real Madrid. Madrid. Oh, it's a fantastic ball from Gibbs White. And Torres. Jota. Oh, he's put it home. A brisk start and a quick goal. <laughs> I think that's Jota's first goal of the season. Fair play. What a counter attack that was. Well, I said I wanted to play well. And we scored early. Oh, yeah, again. Wall, well, round and nil, sorry. Wolves won. Fantastic little pass in to uh, Jota from Torres. And it's a fantastic finish. Hazard in, Saliba trying to, Saliba's got turned inside out, gives White, oh he's giving it away, Patricio easy for him, throws it straight to Gareth Bale because he was too slow getting up, Martin been done in there, Clivert needs an option, that is poor, wow, that was even worse from Real Madrid that was, didn't catch that what at all, but it's just didn't give each other options. Martin. Oh, it's a fantastic pass. Can Clivert do something with this? Cuts back in again. Curtis Jones, who scored past Real Madrid before. Puts it back into the middle and Clivert's 2-0. Justin Clivert scored his first goal in a wolf shirt. And it is Curtis Jones with another assist. Honestly, Jones is so good. I'm hoping he can be consistent this season as he dropped off last season, but he's just a great player. Fantastic pass, great route. Uh, uh, not a start, great start from them. I thought it'd be an even tougher game. And super cut. Lucky, Jones tried to pass that into. Clivert again. 
This was the one that stood out straight away. What a riveting game this promises to be. Well, we're in for a real belt. They are going to try and tear through my team, apparently. Both teams expected to go deep into this competition. Williams. Saliba. Passing it. Aaron Martin has it. Oh dear. Madrid left uh, club and marked again. And Jones for the third hood. It's a good effort, very good effort. Clive just couldn't get in front of Bale. Bale seems intent on trying to beat my team. Beat us here. Martin ain't gonna beat Bale for pace. Saliba, good defending. Clive, nice pass. Casemiro can't defend that. And Jota's banged it through for Gabby Martinelli. And Martinelli back across. Torres off the off the line. Martinelli again needs an option. Morgan gives White. Jota gives White again. Ah, oh, it's awful that was. The deflection just gave it straight to Madrid. Of course. Well, let me mark. Nacho Fernandez. Hazard. A move of promise. Hazard. Neko's got a tough task dealing with Hazard. But he seems to be dealing with him. Oh, Saliba's fucked that one. Ah, oh, easy save from Patricio. Benzema was offside anyway. Not a great start from Real Madrid. Granted, we got unluck we got lucky just to defend that. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defenses. Dyer, he's been a pretty good centre back. Where's Torres, man? That's where Torres needs to be. He shouldn't be trying to have a shag with fucking Neko Williams. That was poor from Torres. Good pass to Curtis Jones. Down to Martin. Martinelli. Oh, come on. Jones' run was a bit poor, I think, as well. But Martinelli's pass has got to be better. Martin trying to beat Bell off that ball. Good challenge. Dyer does well to clear that. Gives White. Fuck's sake, man. Who is that number fucking 10? Modric. Fuck off, you're not even good, Modric. Five up. Gives White. Martinelli. Jota. Cliver again. Cliver gonna drop it in. Gives White. It's a third. Cliver bags the assist, and Morgan gives White gets a goal for himself. That's fantastic. Three 0 against Real Madrid. What on fucking earth? And um, to be honest, I just think Real Madrid have been shit. The most important thing now is to not crumble. I don't care if we don't score again, but if we can win 3-0, take a clean sheet against one of the best teams in the world, I am happy. Oh dear, fucking Albatricio. No need to make that harder than it was. Martin, and now Cliver. He's got the beating of Walker there. Jota 4-0. Oh dear. It's all gone wrong here for Real Madrid. 4-0 at half time. Against my backup team. Fucking hell. Cliver's been brilliant. Jota's been brilliant. Martinelli's not had a chance. But it's easy. Here's Real Madrid. Can we keep up this fantastic form? Everyone's been fantastic. Well, everyone's been brilliant, but Martinelli's not had a chance in this game to like show anything. Neko Williams is a pretty poor cross. So what? Andrew Robertson. 
Modric. Oh, is William going to get caught out? Oh, he is. Ah, he's done well, though. Again. Got Casemiro chasing him now. Nako has. Curtis Jones had a crack. Oh, Foul straight to Ramjud player. Of course it did. Dyer. Give away a free kick. He completely I missed on that tackle badly. Ashraf Hakim's on for Real Madrid. Oh. Neko not doing his job, not marking Hazard. And Hazard's kicked it out of play anyway. Saliba. Williams. Give way. Martinelli. Von Jota. Martinelli. He's fucked it. He's fucked it wide. That's why I'm training his shooting up. Because Arsenal didn't do shit with him. Honestly, if you train him up, he's one of the most deadliest finishers on the game. Jota. Martinelli, fantastic pass through, and is it a Jota hat trick? It is! Diego Jota scores his first hat trick of the season. Looks like he's going to bring back that form from last year as well. What a game against Real Madrid! <laughs> this is unbelievable. It's fucking Real Madrid, for God's sake. Fantastic pass through, and it's not a Jota scores an unlikely hat trick, I'd say. Um, but fair enough, fair enough to him. Oh, Martin's been caught out. Martin gets the ball back. Clivert, he's probably going to come off, Clivert, but he's had a good game. Can't fault him at all. Martinelli and Clivert, he's had a fantastic, he really has a good, had a good game. Oh, penalty given! Oh dear! That's a red card, surely. It is a red card. Nacho Fernandez sent off in the 63rd minute. Right, for uh, Fernandez. Hundred. Uh, third minute. Who's up for the penalty? Did be Ferran Torres. No, it's not. It's Dyer. Dyer finishes it. Six <laughs> 0 <laughs> Penalty finish from Eric Dyer. He had the best penalty, so I had to give it to him. And uh, wow, fuck me. Wow, I've got nothing to this game. Dyer's uh, penalty. We brought on Daniel Marlon. And we brought on Adama Troyore. And we brought on Everton Senior. Gabby Martinelli has moved into the cam roll. And Marlon going up front. Dormitory on that left side. Neko Williams. Oh my god, what a save. Rube Tricio might have just kept since that clean sheet there. Saliba, I think he could have left that for Dyer. Dyer had that one. Benzema comes off for Jovic. Evtesinho headers it away and somehow has fallen back, straight back to a Real Madrid player. Nakimi and Saliba, it's another corner. Gotta get rid of it, boys, gotta get rid of it. Oh, God, for God's sake. Ah, it's an easy goal. Oh, wow. Casemiro, Real Madrid has been off it. And you know what? It's proven by the, by the scoreline, really. They've just been shit. Tony Crowe's trying to deal with Torres. Martinelli. Marlon in behind. Marlon is a fantastic save from Courtois and Fairness. Good effort from Marlon. Ball in again. Eric Dyer. Dyer wins that well. Saliba. And Adama. Oh wow, fuck's sake man. 
doesn't cancel what I tell it what really, really didn't cancel what I told him to do that was just shit from the damn really and me Cut Jones was fouled a bit in there oh Martinelli good effort seven Martinelli worked well there uh, he got that goal 7-0 to Wolves fuck me this is embarrassing Guys, I have not changed the fucking difficulty either. It's it's properly this is legendary. Again, uh, seven nil. I got nothing. I I legit have got nothing to just guys. This is poor. I know you guys want to see me lose a lot, but or like see me come back in game or whatever it is. Fucking hell, if we're going to be playing like this against Real Madrid with our backup team, what can we do against these with our main team? Probably lose, actually. Evcenio is in. Uh, that was a shit cross. Marlon instead. Martinelli just tried to tap, tap it in. Courtois kicks it away and Jones wins it. Senior. Oh, that was just shit from my referee. Jones. Walker now. Walker. Hakimi. Granted, I know Real Madrid are down to 10 men, but. Uh, yeah. Wow, they're just. They're pissing about with it like they're fucking winning. That, I love that about this game. They're getting spanked 7-0 and they're not even trying to score goals. They, they're just they're holding the ball, passing back. Well, look at this. It's embarrassing. And that is a fantastic save. And Dyer done well there. Marlon passed it back to Martinelli. And we just torn their defence apart again, it looks like. And Jones makes it eight. Curtis Jones scores another goal for the club. He scores another goal past Real Madrid this season. I, I'm honestly... That was too easy for us. Watch this. Dama. Marlon. Bang, finish. Curtis Jones bags a goal, which I think is fully, uh, fully deserved from him. He's had a great game again. Uh, just see it out now. Sleeper and Dyer, well done again. Them two are just a strong gas defence. Um, yeah, wow, well, what a game. What a fucking game. 8 <laughs> 0 against Real Madrid. That's unbelievable. On. <laughs> I can't believe we just won 8 0. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you guys for watching this episode. Um, it was a great episode. Again, big, tough win again, tough game against Tottenham, big win against Millwall, and probably the biggest result of our fucking. of all time against Real Madrid. Um, I have a bad feeling I will play Real Madrid again after the group stages, though. I will play them again one day. So, anyway, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video.